As part of today's 9-11 events in the metro, dozens of people are braving temperatures in the 90s as they participate in the Patriots run in Olathe. Shannon Halligan is live at the race where organizers are working hard to keep everyone cool. Shannon? Well, some of these runners have been out here since noon, but they've got plenty of water and they've got these ice towels that they're handing out to runners as they come by to try and keep them cool. But some of this heat did keep people away this year. 170 people started at around noon. That's down from last year. But there's one person who's back again this year who's trying to break the record. His name is Farhad Zarif, and he's from Afghanistan, and his brother is serving alongside the U.S. Army. Army there now. This run is extra special to him and his family, so he's trying to run more than 63 miles in the nine hours and 11 minutes. Firefighters and other emergency responders are paying extra close attention to him because of this heat. And, but for everyone else, they've got EMT, chiropractors, they're handing out water, ice towels, and food along the course. We're watching him. The fire department's got him in their, in their scope, and they're watching him. And we're making sure that if he's going to try to do that kind of a run, that he is well watched, you know, and, and we're going to do everything we can to keep him healthy today. And each loop around here is a mile, and that's so organizers can keep an eye on everyone who is running, and this, including this guy who seems to be very hot because of all of this heat today. That's a tough run out there. But on 41 Action News at 6, hear from parents who lost their son in the Pentagon attack and why they come here every year. Live in Olathe, Shannon Halligan, 41 Action News.